documented Israel's wars, political leaders, and events that would change the future of the country forever. And now, internationally acclaimed photographer Micha Baram's work is being featured in both a documentary film and an art exhibition at the Tel Aviv Museum. From iconic images of soldiers in Jerusalem during the 1967 Six-Day War, to intimate family moments, Baram spent his life chronicling Israeli history. I had the naive hope that photography would make things better. The way I saw it, there was something very positive about photography. But later on I understood that when I received a photography prize, perhaps it made me feel better, but it didn't do any good to the person being photographed. Over his decades-long career, Micha Baram captured some of the most striking images of Israeli life. It's from his archive of more than half a million pictures that filmmaker Ron Tal created his documentary. The film, 1,341 Frames of Love and War, is told through the lens of Baram via a collage of still images. It explores the memories of atrocities and wars that the artist documented. I wanted to make a film about the person who records history, a person whose role it is to document it so that afterwards we can tell the stories that we want to tell. For me, Micha Bar-Am was one of the greatest chroniclers in this area. But it's thanks to Orna, Micha's wife and herself an artist, that her husband's work has been preserved. In fact, she is the one who created a massive archive out of hundreds of thousands of pictures. Who are you he would go out to shoot and I would write things down. Every picture he took received a number, all in chronological order, details and subject. I wrote everything down in a thick notebook. I have three of these work logs. I hadn't studied archiving, but the photos were piling up and I had to find an order in that. In the upcoming exhibition, The Last Photograph, Ran Tal after Micha Baram, the Tel Aviv Museum of Art transforms Tal's documentary into a multi-station video installation. Visitors can view and listen to segments of the film. Ran Tal recorded such amazingly intimate conversations with Micha and his wife and, the, and their uh, kids that um, I wanted to have it as, you know, um, again, as intimate as possible. Baram's work has appeared on the covers of some of the world's most important publications and his photos have shaped our understanding of Israeli history. It's this legacy that he hopes to leave behind. I concentrated on things that interested me, and this was part of the adventure of life. At 92 years of age, I can at least say that I've had a positive and interesting life. I've left behind a body of work that anyone can perceive as they wish. The last photograph, Ran Tal after Micha Baram, will run from June 17th to December 17th at the Tel Aviv Museum of Art. Tal's film, 1,341 Frames of Love and War, will be released in North America at the end of the summer. From Tel Aviv, Maya Margit, reporting for The Media Line.